he knew he could make whoever smile. And that brought a lot, a lot of customers to him. A lot of people in the community appreciated his smile, you know, appreciated his laughter. Well, hundreds of family and friends gathered today in memory of Vishal Patel, the owner of the Quick Sack in Hermitage, tragically killed Monday. Welcome to News 2 at 4. I'm Mark Kelly. And I'm Alex Dennis. Stephanie Langston was invited to the funeral where she spoke with loved ones. Steph, it was a very emotional day for many. It was heartbreaking, Alex. The funeral standing room only, a true testament to just how well loved Vishal Patel was. His family inviting us inside the service, telling me they wanted to show just how many people are suffering from this senseless killing. With profound grief and sorrow, prayers echoed through every room of Highland Hills Funeral Home. Feet from the open casket, Vishal Patel's wife, a difficult sight to witness as loved ones consoled the newly widowed mother. From India to America, a move Vishal made a decade ago, his values and work ethic leading by example for family like Payush Patel. We're deeply going to miss that. We're deeply going to miss, miss him so much. Yeah, I, I, it's, 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 we're, we're, we're lost at words. We don't know how we will, if ever, we'll be able to process such a big loss. Much of Vishal's family now right here in Tennessee. He was an inspiration to a lot of us in the family. A family bonded by religious beliefs and culture. We always were, you know, we were always like family. It was, it was always, he was, he, he was always there. Vishal, known for making others smile, a gift often witnessed through the eyes of his nine-year-old daughter. He was an incredible father. He, he loved his daughter so much. You could tell every time they were together, he was making her laugh. He was making her feel like she was loved. I can't face her right now. I tried yesterday, and all I did is hug and cry because I couldn't, I don't know. We, like I said, we we're always as a family and together and everything. So seeing them right now, just breaks all of our hearts. Seeing his wife and his daughter, his parents are, are heartbroken. Morning, while grasping the reality of moving forward without the man they say lived up to his name, the shawl, meaning grand, immense, great, adjectives fitting for the heartache inside this room. The loss is so big for us that it's, it's, it's a world loss to us. To an entire world that we'll never see again. We'll never see a smile again. That's it. So sad. Now, State Representative Darren Jernigan spoke at the funeral, giving Patel's loved ones a sense of hope that the streets will be safer. We'll hear from him coming up on News 2 at 5. Now, also, a GoFundMe account has been set up to help Vishal's wife and daughter. We have a link to that on our website, wkrn.com. Alex.